Everything about Argus exemplifies what MicroX is. It is what it is because we weren't satisfied with the current design and we thought there could be a better way to do it. We we're constantly asking why. Why can't it be simpler? What was going to deliver the best outcome for the customer? I've been involved with the EOD community my whole life, from my dad being in the Navy to, to me. The more I started to learn about Argus and what MicroX was doing with the technology and how they were trying to apply that to the bomb disposal community, I wanted to be part of it. For me, the opportunity to be engaged at this level was unheard of in the industry, especially in Australia. Right from the outset, we were speaking with local EOD technicians, everyone involved in the police, the army, the FBI. First thing we really tried to understand is what is their current workflow, what are the challenges they face, and then if presented with a different technology, how they might want to use it. This has fed the entire design process. Currently you have to take down an x-ray generator and an x-ray panel. You have to approach the suspect item. Historically, that's meant someone going down in a bomb suit that's large and cumbersome. That can take half an hour to an hour. Quite often you don't even know what you're up against. What Argus is trying to solve, it's that single system, all enclosed. Our miniaturized x-ray is able to look inside the object without having to place a detector behind it. So now I can put it on a robot, send the robot downrange, take multiple pictures, remove the bomb technician from the actual hazard. This is a completely different workflow, enabling the use of a robot to actually do all of the risky work before a human needs to get involved. If we can inform the end user really quickly by not having to approach it, that's game changing, that's how I see it. The Argus is fundamentally three unique pieces of technology, a tube, a generator, and the detector. To have a grounded anode tube coupled directly to a generator, no one else in the world has ever even thought to do something like that. Seeing it in real life, touching it, I was very impressed how elegantly simple it is, super easy to use. Leveraging the fact that it's so light, so rugged, so flexible, it becomes a platform that we can use in a whole bunch of applications beyond EOD. It could be a smaller product that could be used for non-destructive testing. Capabilities like identification of componentry, we can get to 3D imaging. The team are never satisfied with being good and everybody pushes each other and themselves to the next great idea and the next great piece of design. The Argus where it is today is just the beginning. There's a huge amount of ways that it can grow both in its use and in the way that we develop the technology further. What Argus does is provide the bomb technician a tool that didn't exist before. They're volunteering to do an extremely dangerous job. Anything that I can do to help them make their job easier, I want to be a part of that.